it's Renee. Welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I wanted to do a haul with Simply Bee. So just a little disclaimer, I have ordered things from Simply Bee before, but I've only ever ordered, I ordered a, it was like a overall dress, which I really did like, but I've never really ordered full on clothes. I've just ordered that and then I've ordered two pairs of boots. If you're looking for good wide foot, wide calf boots, Simply Bee has great options because you can kind of like look at like their size measurements for your calf and then you can compare it to the sizes that they have. So I got some taller boots from them and I believe that I'm like a triple E in like their calf size for their boots. It's something like that. But it's really cool they do that with like all their shoes and like for the width and everything. But yeah, I wanted to do a full blown haul. I follow Glitter and Lasers on YouTube and on Instagram and I think that she has a really cool sense of style that I relate to a lot. So looking through and I saw that she actually had a discount code with them. She has a couple and I used her Anna 40 one and then she also has one that's Glitter 30. That one apparently though says expires on the 16th of this month. So I wanted to make sure that I got this up in the next couple of days just so if you guys wanted to order anything could. So I pretty much just ordered all sale stuff because Simply Bee does have a lot of really cute stuff. And it's kind of confusing to kind of go by because if you're looking at their sales stuff, some of their stuff will be like, oh, now from like $12.99 or whatever. And you're like, oh, cool. But then maybe the color that they show or the color that you want won't be on sale and it'll be like another color. But I'm actually like really happy with like every single thing that I got except for one item. If you wanted to see kind of what I thought of the clothes, how the whole shipping process went, how the items fit on me, stay Stay tuned and we'll get into it. So just to let you know how much I paid, so when I used her discount code, because I used the 40% off discount code, it was like Anna40, I'll put it down in the description if you want to use it, had about $100 worth of stuff in there, at least on clearance, and then I used Anna40, and then my total ended up being $65.95, which I feel like is really good, because I got about nine items. So when Simply Bee sends you, I can't give you like a price per item thing, because they don't show you that on there. Like it doesn't show you how much individually you got per item. It's just however much it added up to. They just took off however much it was. So they just did like the 40% off of whatever. But I did the math and nine goes into 65. It's around $7.30 per item, which I feel like is really, really good. And I'm honestly thinking that before the code expires of ordering some more stuff because I was so happy with everything that I got. But yeah, I just wanted to show you everything. So let's get into everything. For the first item, I got some jeans. These are gonna be originally the most expensive thing because they were $27.99 originally and just kind of how everything factored out. I'm just not even gonna, I'm not even gonna tell you the individual price for them. I'm just gonna link everything down below that I can find that they still have on their site. Cause some of the stuff isn't on there anymore but some of it still is cause this is all sale items because I wanna try out cute brands but Sometimes cute brands are very expensive. But yeah, these are some of their Simply Be denim line. This is their Chloe Skinny. It's in, in a US 26. So even though it's a UK company, you can still filter everything by US sizes. So when I looked up these, them up as a US 26 and they're a 30 regular in UK sizing. And I don't think I've ever had a pair of jeans fit me this well that are this like good of a length on me. So like the only other jeans that I'd say my perfect fitting jeans would have to be my lovesick jeans that I ended up actually buying from Torrid, which was like their sister store, but it shut down and I'm really sad about it because those black jeans are my most favorite jeans ever. These honestly give those a run for their money. But they're just a really nice kind of, what is this, like a medium wash, so cute. They fit me really, really well. They're just really comfortable. They have front pockets. I've never owned this many jeans with front pockets before because I've only ever really bought like jeggings and stuff. And so it's kind of exciting, even though I don't ever use them. But yeah, they have two holes in the knee, so they are distressed. I love distressed jeans. Hopefully they never go out of style. But yeah, they're just a really good fit on me. I really like how like the length is. Like to me, like this is a regular because I feel like my regulars from Torrid are actually a little bit short on me because I think they're a... Uh, they're like a 29 inch inseam and I feel like truthfully even though my legs are short I feel like a 30 or 31 inseam tends to fit me a little bit better but these ones actually I'm pretty sure I got in a 29 inseam and they're like perfect so I don't know what is up I don't know if Torrid's jeans just run kind of like shorter but maybe all I know is that I really like these I think they're super comfortable like I said they're in their Chloe skinny brand or in their Chloe skinny design and I kind of want to order more they're 
so cute. I love them a lot. <laughs> and I spend over $60 because then you get free shipping, which I feel like is pretty good. I hate it when brands do like $75 or $100 because I feel like that's just kind of a lot for free shipping. This actually felt like it was pretty reasonable. For $60, bucks, I got free shipping. This is actually another pair of jeans that I bought, and I think I added them to my cart just so I could get free shipping because I think my total purchase was going to be $55, and then it was going to be like $7 shipping, and I was like, well, let's just add another like $10 item if I'm gonna pay $7 for shipping and then we'll just get free shipping like whatever and so these I think were originally like they ended up being about like $10 and then you know the whole $7 thing and not gonna lie I kind of am questioning my decision on buying them until I thought of a genius thing to do so I don't know why I bought these in a long I think because I messed up on the inseam because I thought because I'm so used to torrid sizing that I'm used to having to get like talls in torrid jeans because the regulars are a little too short for me. I got longer jeans this time because I was like, oh yeah, like that makes sense. That's my typical inseam, but these are really long. These are actually some straight black jeans. They're, yes, and they're from this brand called Anthology Denim Collection. These are, yeah, in a US 26. And I was like not a fan because they're supposed to be like straight jeans. And I was like, oh cool, like I haven't had straight jeans in forever. Like, you know, why not? And so I tried them on. I would consider these straight flares they're more like flare jeans honestly which i'm not the biggest fan of but they're super high-waisted and they're really comfortable and i was like you know what what i've done before when i got straight jeans i cuffed them up and i turned them into boyfriend jeans and they're perfect for that like these are like the perfect boyfriend jeans for me because even though the legs are big i was able to cuff them up at the bottom i ended up cuffing them up just because i felt like they looked a lot better on me i felt they were a lot more flattering on me that way i actually ended up putting them in my coachella lookbook the whole kind of more like flare look, but just with a little bit of a cuff. Actually, no, I feel like these jeans would be really good for wearing to like the beach. I feel like these would be really great to kind of throw on, maybe throw on like a flowy shirt or just wear with like your bikini top or your swim top, throw on some sandals and like they're just so comfortable. They'd also be really cute with like a sun hat and just like a white t-shirt and a kimono. Like I just feel like I have so many ideas now for these jeans now that like I've gotten past the length and I just think they're so cute and they're jeans that I've been looking for but didn't realize it because I made a size mistake. But yeah, super cute, really great price, liked them a lot. Now this is one of the shirts that I got. I ended up getting two of the same shirts, but in different colors. This is from this brand called Capsule, and it says your ultimate wardrobe staples. But yeah, I actually, it's a really cute kind of, I think it's called a Bardot top, and it's really nice because it can go off my shoulder because it has like this little crisscross right here to give you that Bardot effect or you can have it off your shoulders or you can kind of pull it up if you just want it as a regular t-shirt. This is just a black one. Like I said, so I got this, I got everything except for one item in a US 26, just because it's generally what size I am. Sometimes I'm a 24, sometimes I'm a 3X, 4X. Yeah, I really like this shirt. It's very, very soft. I like this so much and it's so comfortable. It's really soft and it kind of adds a little bit to your look instead of just being like a typical like black t-shirt which I feel like is really nice because I have a shit ton of black t-shirts. Having like a little bit of a nicer black t-shirt is great if you want to be casual but maybe just a little bit more dressed up casual and I like I said I ordered it in a white one as well and I just thought that they were so cute and I like this one a lot too I feel like it's great with jeans like they're both great with jeans this I think would be really cute with like a pair of shorts and like a denim jacket like some flowy shorts and a denim jacket just to be kind of comfy and casual and cute but still like fun now for the next item i actually really like this too it's not my favorite in the sleeves but i feel like it's still very comfortable and very cute this is again from that capsule brand yeah i really actually like this a lot it's very comfortable and very cute the only thing i don't like is that the sleeves are big and i was like oh why are they like that and then i saw this button here and you can actually pull them up and button them i just think that they're kind of an awkward length to do that and i'm like you know I honestly don't mind them like this. This is a very good, like, I feel like lounge around the house cardigan in, which I'm always down for. I love being comfortable. This just, it kind of reminds me, like, you know how, like, when you pull up like that and then you leave it there for a long time and then you pull it forward? That's kind of what this reminds me of. It's like, it's a little stretched out, but they're not bad. Like I said, I do like it. It's very soft. It's very comfortable. It's a very easy cardigan. Again, I just, I don't, I don't get the sleeves, but... You know, Capsule clearly makes really nice stuff. They make very soft things. Like these are definitely like that very, just like soft feeling kind of t-shirt. Like those are like soft t-shirts. This is just a very soft cardigan. Like I said, I would probably just wear this maybe like at night 
some pajamas or even then I'd probably honestly if I'm running errands I would totally wear this too it's kind of easy it's just if you notice when I'm talking like if I was like talking with my hands I would hate being like this so yeah it's a little bit awkward but I feel like the length is very good on me it also has pockets but they're literally just like little squares and so they're like for show pockets because they won't hold anything they won't even hold like a phone but I do really like it like I said the quality is really nice the only thing about it this is the type of fabric though that also balls like pretty quickly so that's always something to think about too but yeah overall I like it so this is actually probably the only item that it does fit it just doesn't really fit me well it's actually like kind of snug so this is another item from capsule and I just apparently was on a capsule run and I didn't even realize it until I got the items but I really liked it so I don't own any pencil skirts and eventually like pretty soon I'm probably gonna start actually looking for like actual full-blown employment right now I just work like part-time job I'm in school but I do kind of want to start kind of expanding my experience because in this job market you need experience to get anywhere in life and so time to look for some professional stuff so this is actually a really cute pencil skirt it has a nice little slit in the side to give you room for your legs and like I said it does fit it's just that it only really fits standing up and you for sure this is something you would have to zip up yourself but you'd have to do it from the front and then find a way to slide it to the back because this part up here where the waist is because there is stretching there's a lot of elastic on both sides that it actually fits really well like kind of too big in the waist area but the lower part is much tighter than the top so there's way more room up in the waistband than there is in the actual skirt which I feel like doesn't make a lot of sense to me just because I'm like well, why wouldn't you have that stretch all throughout or just make it bigger I don't know it was kind of strange so it doesn't really fit me it is kind of tight I don't know how comfortable it would be to sit down in just because I'm afraid that it might tear but you know overall it's not a bad skirt it's just a little snug on me it's a really good length on me though there's another item from capsule so I guess I mean I don't really know if harem pants are that's what they're called I don't I know that's like not a great term for them but that's just what they're called on the site but they're like kind of those more like billy pants where they kind of cinch in at the ankles but I really really liked those and I've never found any in my size that I have really liked a lot and these ones aren't bad so yeah these are some more these are the harem pants from capsule but yeah this is really cute and really comfortable and it does kind of give you that billowy leg look but it's not quite what I was looking for they're more like just kind of I have like thicker thighs and thicker calves and if I had skinnier legs I think that it would give me that more kind of billowed look but I do like I said I have thicker legs and so it doesn't really they're also a little short on me which is kind of funny but honestly to me now they're just like really comfortable leggings and they have pockets in them so like if you're just kind of looking for like to me these are good like errand pants they are a little see-through like but it is great just to have pants that have pockets in them again these are in a size 26 but they're just so cute and comfortable and I like them a lot honestly I tried them on with like a crop top and like some sandals and I was like oh my god I love these these are some good like effortless pants and no one has to know really that you're just wearing like billowy pants but yeah I might order because they still have them online I might order a size up if I want that more billowed effect I'm not sure still haven't decided we'll see but I really do like them I think they're so comfortable because like I said they're a little short and they're not quite what I was going for but I also just got some leggings these are some nice like big paneled leggings I like it when things have like a big waistband because I feel like for me because my like just how my body is shaped I feel like it's easier for me to keep things up rather than having like a small waistband because it just gives me that like extra fabric that I need for it but yeah these are super comfortable they're a good length on me and I feel like you always need just a really good like essential pair of black leggings like I love black leggings I haven't owned a ton in the last few years because I've been focused more on buying jeans because I didn't have a lot of jeans at one point and so now I'm kind of getting back into just buying both but yeah I really really like these they're super comfortable they're super great good length on me and yeah I feel like that's kind of been the general thing about simply be so far is that everything fits me pretty well except for the skirt they're all really comfortable they're all a really good length on me and they just fit well like they lay really well for just I don't know like I've just never had a Paul where I like pretty much everything 
except for when I ordered stuff from like Charlotte Russe. Like I feel like sometimes when you order things online, you do run into the risk of being like, okay, well, I'm probably not gonna like some of the items and pretty much every single item I have liked, even that skirt I like, I just don't like how it fits because it doesn't fit that great. But literally everything that I've ordered, I like a lot from them. So I'm really excited to order more things. Like I said, I have another, I'm gonna probably order some more stuff just because I have a shopping addiction and I love clothes. So I feel like probably I could see maybe myself getting hyped up right now and then maybe being disappointed in other clothes that I buy just because I had a really great first experience. But I'm hoping that more stuff that I order will be just as good as this. So pray for me if I do end up ordering more things. And then the last item, this was in actually a size 24. Yeah, UK 28, a US 24. And these fit me so well. I got kind of scared. I have one swim swimsuit that I ordered from Amazon and it just doesn't fit me well at all. It's like so small. <laughs> And I kind of keep it to kind of compare other swimsuits that I buy from other places just to see. Because sometimes it can be hard to tell like before you try it on. I sized it up to those ones and they were kind of similar. This was like maybe an inch or two bigger. And I was like, oh man, it probably isn't going to fit like that great. I tried it on and it's because it's so stretchy. And because this part's really stretchy too, I normally get 26s in my bottoms or like I'll get like from Torrid, their fours are like a 24, 26. That's typically what I get from them. And I feel like this is a true like 24 size bottom. I really like it. It has this fun, the more like the hibiscus flowers on it. But yeah, I really, really like it a lot. They fit me really well. It's maybe a little bit lower on my stomach than I would like. I typically like those, they're more I think called like mid bikinis where like you have like a little bit of midriff showing, but not like a ton just because that's, the style I like. I'm not like a full on bikini person just because I'm just not. I wish I was, but body issues. So, but yeah, I actually really do like these a lot. I think they're really cute. They're really comfortable. They're great because like I said, I'm always on the mission to find bottoms that'll go with a black top because I want to do a more comprehensive lookbook on how to like shop for cute swimsuits, but like be affordable about it and how to make multiple swimsuits out of limited pieces. But yeah, I really like these. These are really great, really, really good price. I'm really excited to wear them. But yeah, that's everything. I hope you enjoyed this haul. I honestly, like I said, I really liked everything that I bought. I was super worried that I was gonna order this and just hate everything, have to send it back or keep it if their return policy isn't very good. Oh, that's cool. So Simply V actually does do free returns. So maybe I will return that skirt and get another one because I really do like it. It's just not quite my size I'm not sure but yeah and then I ended up getting free shipping because I spent over $60 what you can do if you spend over $60 is you can upgrade for four more dollars to like expedited shipping whereas I just did the standard seven to ten working day shipping and it took about that I think it took about nine days which is a little slow but I'm not too worried about it at least it's like sometimes when I used to order from Torrid more often I wouldn't get items for like a month because they were having warehouse issues so I'm pretty used to waiting so it's not that big of a deal. I really like I said I'm really happy with this haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the clothes that I bought. Like I said I'm probably gonna order some more stuff. So like I said I used the code Anna40 from Glitter and Lasers. I'll put that down there if you want to use it. It as of today it's Thursday when I'm filming this. Still working for me and she also has another one for Glitter30 so always try that one too if the Anna 41 ends up not working. I think the 31 ends on like the 16th according to her Instagram. So definitely if you want anything, recommend checking out their sales site, checking out their regular site. And generally on like their new stuff, they usually have sales going on as well. So that's always something to look into. Also always check Retail Me Not. They always have coupon codes for them. That's how I ordered overall dress from them before. But yeah, overall, like I said, Really, really liked it, really enjoyed it. Probably I'm gonna order some more stuff. There's some really cute shoes that I've been wanting that I was looking at and I want them bad. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like down below, comment and subscribe. It'd be great to have you here. Again, my name's Renee, thanks for watching, bye.